Hey guys, it's Rob from back at you one more again. I hope you are doing fabulous on this sensational, prosperous Sunday. I'm coming back for a part two. But if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, love and blessings to you, and love and light. And thank you for coming to see what I'm about. Please like and subscribe, hit that notification button, and hit that bell when you want to see when I'm about to upload my next video. If you're a returning sub, thank you, love and light, and thanks for the support, and love and blessings to you, and namaste. Today, my video is about Twin Flame 101, Be the Reflection You Enjoy Seeing. Oh, she's like, what? Be the, be the reflection you enjoy seeing. Not everybody enjoys the reflection that they see, and I'm not just talking about physical. And sometimes it could be physical, and sometimes it can be ex external. I mean external, but internal. And I'm talking about the internal. There's people that they feel that, you know, are, they can be very beautiful, like models or superstars or whatever. It could be anybody. But you might think they're the most beautiful person in the world. Most beautiful in the world. I'm sorry. I had to retort and correct myself. The most beautiful person in the world. But they might not feel that they're the most beautiful person in the world. You never know. But you have to be able to enjoy the reflection you're seeing. I'm about to get on some deep stuff today. I mean, I was really feeling today. You know, when I made my last video, I was just like, oh my gosh, I'm proud of myself. My frequency is off the freaking charts. My vibes are high as I don't know what. And I felt like just sharing more with you guys. And it feels so good to be this way. It's just like if you enjoy... I enjoy being the reflection that I'm seeing. I mean, it's just like, if, if I was to talk about the physical, yes, there's always some things you can always improve. But my more concern is my soul. My soul. You can be the most prettiest, beautiful, most beautiful person or my, most handsome person and have the most ugliest soul. To me, you can look at two days from now or, you know, two days ago or two weeks from now now or you know like you've heard me say in my videos you know months from now you're never the same person you were yesterday never you're never the same person you were yesterday and it's just like when I show when I feel these things and I have these experiences I love enjoy sharing them with you and maybe it can resonate with you it, and it can probably lead you on a path that you never know you can be on and it's just like, I enjoy that. Like, I reach out to my daughters, and it's just like, we're, you know, we're in different places because they're older and stuff like that. And it's just like, even though they're older, they're still my babies. So I reach out to them, and it, it could be like 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. And, you know, sometimes they can be in a good sleep. And get it, you know, they might have got to turn the notifications off. So babies, if y'all reading this, I'm so, if y'all seeing this, I'm sorry. But it's just all in love. <laughs> But it just, I love it. I love that. Where I can reach out and touch somebody and it could be at that exact moment. You never know when you can uplift somebody's spirits and, up, you know, get that, that coldness ice chisel off their heart. And you can just up, put a smile on somebody's face, put, hear that laughter that comes out. And, you know, they're like, you know what, you made me feel so much better. You know, and it's just the comments that I feel is just like, oh, my gosh, you really hit home. And thank you, you know, for sharing this with me. You know, that makes me feel so good. That lets me know I can, my heart, my soul is just like rejuvenating. It's just like it died and come back. And it's all a different person. And I enjoy that. It's just like when, when I can go out and I can tell somebody my story. And it's just like, wow, you've been through this and you're okay. I'm like, yeah, I have my day. But this right here, this is what I concentrate on. You know, I, I had to stop concentrating on what my family did to me. I had, to I, had, I had to stop concentrating on the fact that me and my dad were separated. My dad doesn't want me thinking about the fact that he doesn't want me thinking about the fact of what they did to me. Let that be dealt with. Let, you know, throw that down. I had to throw everything down and just say, live for the moment, but improve yourself in this process. Enjoy what you're seeing. If you don't enjoy what you see, please change it. Don't sit up here and complain about it and not do nothing about it. Change it. Just change it. And it makes you feel, it's like you're doing it 
a makeover on your soul. And that's what I'm doing. And I enjoy the reflection that I'm seeing. And it's just like I know I'm becoming my higher self. It's just like that, you know, I talk to my homegirl and it's just, I thank her so much for, you know, just being there to talk to me. And it's just so many people have not been there, you know, and there are so many people that has been there. And I, I appreciate everything. Even the ones that weren't even there, I appreciate that because it made me learn myself more, made me want to know, you know, made me just basically say, you know what, you know what you accept and you know what you won't accept. You know what things you'll tolerate and what you won't tolerate. When you speak up front and let people know this is how it is and this is how it will be with me or whatever, and you keep that respect, there won't be any problems. And before, I used to let people walk all over me, do things, and I see things, and I might not even, I peek game, and I don't even say anything. I just let it go. I just let it go. Because it's just like, when you when you concentrate on that, it takes away from your spiritual. And that's going to be another video that I'm going to talk about. You know, it, it takes away from a, a, the spiritual part. So that's why I have to concentrate on. I can't sit up here and be talk, concentrate on things that I cannot change. I'll tell y'all on a video, but stop concentrating on the things you cannot change. Concentrate on working, working on yourself, and the rest will follow right along in suit. It's just when I start dropping everything on the negative sense, I start dropping things that didn't resonate with me. Stop dealing with the people that I stopped dealing with, and start bringing in people that that have been common with me. You know, you might have those ones that, you know, it's whatever and it's fine. But you're learning from that. You know what you're going to deal with. You know what you're not going to deal with. But I'm not going to hold you guys up today. And I hope you had a blessed weekend. And I will talk to you later. And peace and be wild. And please, please love you all. And please do. Much love. Bye.